Product attributes can be easily created in the admin panel. As you can see in the default demo now, there are a few attributes like lamp brand, lamp collection, and lamp material, but for the purpose of this tutorial, we will create a new text attribute. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will create an attribute for the t-shirt designer that you are able to add and fulfill to each product that you wish. As you can see, you can add a position to your new product attribute, the type of an attribute is already selected. When it comes to your attributes configuration, you can select a minimum and maximum length. In the next step, you will fill the bar with the name of your attribute, which will be possible to do in different languages as well. And now, as you can see, we have the product attribute successfully created. After the attribute is created, let's move on to the product page and find the t-shirt that you want to edit. From the category menu, select the t-shirt tab to locate your product. Choose the option to edit the product. On the left side of the bar, click on attributes. You can add your new t-shirt designer attribute to this product. It is very simple, click on the bar and select your newly created attribute. Then press add attributes and type the name that you have chosen to your attribute t-shirt designer. For the purpose of this video, it will be Ludovic 30. Don't forget to save your changes. Now you are able to view your product on the store page, which we will proceed by clicking on the tab show product in shop page. As you can see, after the page is loaded, we can easily go to the tab attributes, where we can locate the bar with our attributes. You might want to enhance the search experience based on attributes using our Elasticsearch plugin, which builds the product index based on various product-related entities, including attributes. In this part of the video, we will show you how to create a select type attribute and how to add more values to it. Locate the channel tab by typing a given word in the search engine in the admin panel. Then, edit the channel on which you want to make changes. Under the Locales tab, select the locale you are interested in. For this video, we have chosen Polish. Then, select the currency appropriate to the country you selected earlier and save your changes. Move to the Attributes tab and create a new select attribute. Complete the code field with certificate. Add position. Then, enter the minimum and maximum values in the configuration field and check the multiple box. Enter the attribute's name in English and Polish in the fields provided. To add the remaining values, press the Add button just above the multiple option, which we have already enabled. Now you can add a name to the values you want to be presented. Remember to name the values in both languages. English and Polish. For this recording, we will create three additional values whose names are random. Once you have named all the values, click on the Create button to create them. Now, go to the Products tab and locate the product you are interested in. For this video, we chose a simple product, a cap. The product was searched using a filter that enabled us to find the product much faster. Once you have located the product, click on the Edit option. Then go to the Attributes tab and add the newly created attribute. As you can see, there are several values next to each locale, which we have created. Select the first one in each locale. For this recording, we will additionally select the last three values in the field with the locale Polish so we can present you with the changes we have made. Save the applied changes and present the product on the page.
As you can see, in the case of presenting our product in the US market, we have to deal with only one value in a given attribute according to the data we selected earlier. But, on the other hand, if we choose the locale Polish, we will see that there will be more of these values in a given attribute, exactly as many as we selected in the administration panel.